not so long ago, if you would have entered the Westminster Seminary Library through the glass doors, on the right, you'd see shelves and shelves of books, and beyond them, just one study carol against the wall. These are usually reserved for PhD students, and usually they're off the beaten path in a quiet area, but this one was a little closer to where a lot of students would walk to get to the stairs. This was my study carol. And so I would have people visit me who were walking by and we'd talk. And one person who I probably had the, the most conversations with and probably I'd say the most rewarding conversations with is our guest preacher this Sunday, Alistair Groves. Alistair, a master student at the time and a fellow new lifer. He is a child of this church, however, unlike me. As you probably know, he is the son of Al and Libby Groves. And now, the executive director of CCEF, the Christian Counseling and Educational Foundation. Well, we would have great conversations about things like counseling, or my field was theology and apologetics, or the Bible, or sports, of course. Well, sometimes those conversations ran long, wonderfully long, I should say. And I'd come home and my wife wanted to know if I had a really productive day. We were raising kids and, and how, how to go. And I would say, well, I didn't get everything done I wanted to today. I had a great conversation with Alistair though, and it'll be really great in the long run. I just didn't get my immediate assignment done today. Well, we did talk a lot, and I remember one more story here. As Alistair got into counseling and moved, in, moved to New England, where he still lives today, and I said to him, you know, I've been thinking about counseling in apologetics. And he said to me, huh, you know, I've been thinking about apologetics in counseling. And so he just had an appreciation of our two areas of ministry and, and study intersecting with each other's. Well, anyway, we're so blessed to have Alistair preaching this week. And what's he going to be preaching on Sunday? Treasure. As a counselor, he has a way of speaking and getting to the heart on things we feel, things we think, why we do the things we do, how the gospel impacts our life. And the matter of treasure, we maybe don't talk about much. Well, I'm looking forward to hearing what he has to say. Please join us for worship on Sunday morning. And we do have a luncheon, our monthly Smorgas lunch after the second service. And I've asked Alistair to stick around uh, which, of course, he will do in hopes of talking to people like you. So maybe it's time to reconnect with him or meet him for the first time. Take care, everyone. God's blessings.